Hey guys, welcome back to the YouTube channel. My name is Kadil Vlogs. I record local cartoons right here in Trinidad. So it's not just our river day. Drift motion. This is the final event for the year. So I'll say you no. Know, I must make a pass through. Wait, this the sunlight in real different. <laughs> but yeah. So I'll say man, just make a pass through. So the vibe and you know, I must hit a little awesome content. So yeah, guys. Are you walking? Are you walking? Go into the um, to the pit area. So. Let me go and see what's the vibe. <laughs> I mean, this. I don't know. Like, this even look at real bad compared to all the other events for the year. This drift motion looking real bad. So yeah. Still coasting for Rukam Salika. I mean Rukam supposed to be down here representing Kulil Vlogs and himself but Rukam does just do things that make me cry you know. But yeah. Small thing. Right now it's still tooting but see what? Like just like something, it has be grieving on him, but we can't do nothing. I didn't check for the roof, I still do them, but yeah. I know life is life. Too. So, guys, I'm going to walk into the room. I'm going to just turn on the camera and show them. I want to walk quite up there, and then I don't walk in the arm, the pit area. So, I reached the pit area, I was at the corner again, so it was your real vibes. So yeah guys, so the original audio for the um for the video, right? I was not using the phone microphone, I was actually using the external microphone that had a spin on my shirt. But due to the music that was playing in the background, the bass sounding was humbugging the microphone from picking up my voice. So it was actually focusing on the background other than my voice. So I had to mute the whole thing because I mean all through this whole pit area here, I was vlogging and talking about the cars and things, right? And all it wasn't here in my voice and I didn't even know until I started editing the video. So I say, you know what? Might as well hit all your voice over. It could be kinda long and it could be a kinda um tall on me, but that is a small thing. I hope I'll let us see what has been going through <laughs> to give all of this good content but nevertheless video time so right now we're watching um this s13 this is shiva one so i was talking about the wheels and i, I was really like any wheels in the front and i was telling all that is the next set from the blue one right next to it there so we're walking across to the wait now this hilux was driven Nah, nah, the silex wasn't your fun. <laughs> but yeah. Walking across to this blue sea to the tree laurel. You know, I can't pass no laurel straight. None. So yeah. Actually, I really like this lip on the arm. On the chunk here. That look good. RB25 classic no bumper. So, yeah. Now, another C33 here. Um, the graphics on this look real good. I was watching the need to work on the bonnet here, too. Awesome oh, cutout line. <laughs> Yeah, this graphics look good. White with white wheels. Yeah. So before this drifter, this drifter is shown, right? So before he had this um Sephiro, he had a um C33 Laurel. That Laurel, <laughs> I was a big fan of it. Sadly, he ended up selling it and he 
changed um, this Sephira now. But yeah. Why do you make boys in Jifton? I like how we put this in Dakula. This in Dakula look nice. So. GZ, GZ Power 180SX. Nice big tool. So this C to the four Laurel is actually one of my partners um vehicle. Right? His name is Jeremy Manuel. So he is actually the next person that I would be doing the interview with the drifters. He is actually the next person. So right now we're just organizing our day and you know perfect timing and stuff. And yeah. He's actually the next person we're gonna be interviewing. RB25 powered C34. Nice, clean, simple build. So, yeah, big up yourself, Jerome. Now, I'm I am really a. Uh, um a motorbike person but this bike real stand out right and i mean all this supposed to don't see why i say it now come on a bike with nitrous yeah that's crazy <laughs> this is actually my, my, my next partner um, vehicle there is um answer this is rb20 powered l200 so again answer big up yourself this van is real walker so do watch it just so this van is a real walk. You know something different, something unique. This next vehicle, A31 Safaro. This car actually real clean. This is this, this car belongs to um, G's performance. Right? Um I spoke to him already about our interview. I wanna keep my interview with he and his Sephiro, not this one, the next one, the next one is the beast. This one is something like a daily, but still, this one real clean. This one real clean, so yeah, I give me points for this. Hello, see, I don't need the engine be just now. So yeah, clean on the outside, clean on the inside. This is what we're talking about, proper thing. We have a clean S14 here. You know the legendary SR20 turbo. And while I was pointing in on my plate and saying, I was saying the registered thing. No, no unregistered thing. <laughs> registered thing, so. Yeah. I actually really admire the, the, um, the wheels on this. The wheels on this look real, real clean and nice. I feel like it look real good on a laurel, you know. Yeah. I like the um, bright bucket seats inside. I like this this clean white roll cage. Yeah, so props to the owner. Scabella real proper. Nice and simple one, you know. Not too not too extreme, but at the same time too. Decent and it it, it look real good. It look real good. I was a big fan of it. E31 Sephiro. Um, this is actually Yasin brother. So is is two brothers, Yasin and Craps, I forget his name, but yeah. Um, I think it was a BC in the name. Somewhere along the car. But yeah, it's two brothers. Shiraz. Like I see the name on the, the back last day. 
Shiraz. So it's Yasin and Shiraz, his two brothers with his drift. Very impressive too. So like the brother um vehicle here. The next Sephira is so can I would know the Yasin. So I'm still trying to get familiar with um some of the drifters name and thing because I mean it, it, it's kinda a lot. It's kinda a lot. That is our next thing to it. In my opinion, I find drifting in Trinidad is a very big sport. That is the reason why I try my best to highlight it so you know other people from other countries could see Trinidad actually have a big drift game. S14, um this belongs to the Tobago guy. Right? So, I mean, big up the Twin Island, Tobago. So, we had um, this is our next Tobago vehicle, too. Optimum performance. Um, I think something that was fixing, I think something broke or something like that, or something that was changing, something like that. But I mean, the fixing is on the spot. So I get him the points for that. Again, C32 Laurel, my favorite. So, yeah. Um, I think this is the first time I've seen this vehicle on, um, on the track. I, I really didn't, prob probably. Probably I recorded it already and I didn't probably take it on, but I find this the first time I'm actually taking this this 180 SX. This this look cool. This look real cool with this red and this green. I mean red and green is two colours you wouldn't really think about mixing. But somehow he do it and it look good. These headlights too, these headlights look real proper. So yeah, big up studio now. C32 Laurel. This is a um, tune up shop. C33. This guy does work. So, we have a little weird car here, right? So, one hour will pay attention to the number plate 86. And two, pay attention to the badge, Toyota. So this is actually a Toyota GT86, powered by a Nissan SR20 Turbo. Now, me personally, I wouldn't really mix them two brands, but... I mean, it's personal preference, and I mean, it's, it's the owner's preference, so... Yeah. Moral of the story is, this is a very cool car. And... I can't remember how much power it was making, but it was making a good number of powers. Yep, it was working. That car actually tuned in America too, so yeah. Prop studio now. C32 Laurel. I was actually real watching the color in this. The color in this looked real nice. It was like a chameleon purple green color, can I? It looked good. Come on, I must say big up to the Y11, man. I just drive a Y11, so. Come on, I must, I must big up the Y11, man. So yeah, big up all this hell for one time. So this white vehicle be coming up to here, right? I was paying attention to this and trying to figure out what kind of vehicle it is. One, I know it's a rare vehicle. But I watch any handles, the handles, they like a C34 Laurel. But it kind of looking like a Toyota too, right? So I was trying to figure it out. I mean, I'll pose the name on the on the screen here or I get on Google, but I think it's a Gran Turis Gran Turismo or something like that. Right? But I mean, I'll pose the correct thing on the screen. But this look real cool, though. Yeah, this look real cool. We have an next drifter here too, um, Shiva. Yeah, actually, I had a pickup. I was a big fan of that pickup. I read it. Post up it on your screen so I like, could know what I'm talking about. But yeah, he yeah, actually he, he ended up upgrading to the S15, like this one here. So, yeah, I don't, I, I believe yeah, we might be seeing the, the pickup on the, um, on the track again. Maybe, maybe not. But, 
Ya yaraku, yaraku lam. Pick up. Temida was a real crazy bill. So guys, so the competition start already. Um, right now I just going to take a little chill down and detent. And then after that we shall go by um, the Jafari now. So yeah guys.
So hey guys, that was the um the Andari event there. Yeah? Um, yeah, I mean I still kind of come down late, so still try something. Hey yeah, guys, right now we just walking through the pit area here and recording. You know them fellas are them putting out all the tires, you know all the wildness. So yeah, we here. Let me see what the action we can get in the pit area. So guys, so the event is over and we're walking to go back by the car now. So I say, might as well just record the outro one time. The show was nice. The show was real nice. Sadly, I didn't walk with my vest, the reflective vest. So I didn't get, I didn't get that privilege to go close, close to the, to the arena. Right? So. I walk with every single thing and I just fuck with the best. So, uh, it is happening something. I'm still trying my best to get as much footage as possible. And uh, yeah. I hope you all enjoyed this video. Yeah, guys. So, yeah. Right now, we're looking to go up that road there. Um, I want, to, I want to start start back them with them reviews and well I shouldn't just start back I should say continue so yeah look out for more on channel make sure make sure like the video subscribe to the YouTube channel share the video leave a comment below what you think about the, 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 the video and I hope you enjoy this awesome content um, so again guys I appreciate the support a lot and Stay tuned for more awesome content from your boy Colored Vlogs. Hey guys, out. Make sure you be safe out there.